Hi folks, I'm Joe with Premier One Supplies, and today we're going to open up a solar IntelliShock 100 Energizer. Oh, hey, that was already cut. We have our instructions. A note that you should read. It says, stop. For safety reasons, your Energizer is shipped with the battery disconnected, so we're going to connect the battery before we use it. We'll cover that in the video. A little excess cardboard, ground rod. Looks like we have a digital tester for fences and batteries and some connections. Some nesting boxes. Behold, solar IntelliShock. So to get it ready, we're going to connect the battery. So to open the unit, pinch these two prongs and lift or push, and that will open the unit. Inside we have our battery, a ground stake, which we'll set aside for now. This is a 110 volt connector, so if you needed to recharge the battery or run the unit as a 110 unit, you would use this. So to connect the battery, we simply remove the label holding the black lead. Slide it in place. Place it in here. Close the lid. Now before use, we recommend topping off a battery. So you take the unit, bring it towards an outlet, plug in the adapter to the outlet, and the other end plugs into the unit. And we leave that in overnight or so just to get things topped off before we run it. But you can also test the battery with your battery tester. Put that in a safe place. Uh, a good location would be back inside the unit. And open up the bag here. Set my tester to the side. I have two leads, an orange lead and a black lead. The black will be attaching to my ground rod. The orange will attach directly to the fence. Remove the terminal covers. I'm going to do the ground terminal first. And this is a ring that fits over the terminal. And there is a little cutout in the side for you to reach your fingers in there if need be. Tighten that down and I'll just fix this cord in place like so. On to the fence terminal. Push that in. that cable in place like so again just for transport it keeps things tidy the solar IntelliShock 100 has a simple on off button to turn on the energizer press it in to operate green light means that we have a adequately charged battery if this flashes green red that means you need to take the energizer and get it recharged and it flashes red red, you should have recharged it earlier. Or the battery's been significantly drawn down, stop operating the unit if it flashes red red. All right, a few quick notes. The ground spike slides 
into the base of the energizer. The negative lead can connect to that. So this support spike both supports and acts as a ground for the unit. The second pair of black leads can again attach to the ground spike and we'll drive this spike, this ground rod into the ground and that will increase our ground field. Tidy up my area. The solar panel is adjustable. So depending on where you are and what time of year, you'll loosen these two knobs. Adjust the plant panel. You want it horizontal to the when the sun is in, in its highest position in the sky. And you can lock that angle into place. So if you have any questions about Premier or Premier items, you can give us a call at 800-282-6631 or visit our website at premieronesupplies.com. Happy fencing. Thank you.